September is National Preparedness Month, and the California Office of Emergency Services wants to make sure Californians are prepared and ready when a natural disaster strikes. CBS 13's Mark Thompson joins us in the newsroom with more on this story. Mark? Yeah, good evening, Sharin. And wildfires, floods, earthquakes, they're all commonplace in California. So Cal OES is looking to make sure that people are truly ready when disaster strikes. When the flames are bearing down, it's too late to think. The flames were like right there. They were, it was time to go. But what to grab? Where's the family and can I get back home? If someone knocks on your door and says you need to leave in five minutes, that's not the time to scramble. So you need to plan ahead. Cal OES held a day of preparedness in Old Sack this afternoon to help people do just that, complete with disaster demonstrations and life-saving advice. Have a plan. Know what you're going to take with you if an event comes where you need to leave your home immediately. First, pick a meeting spot should the family get separated and make a preparedness kit for 72 hours away from home. Include things like non-perishable food, water, medication, and any important documents. The important papers, passport, and all of that. A flashlight, dusk mask, toys for the kids, and food for the pets. And just as important officials say, practice the plan, because when the time comes... Who knows what to do? You know, it's like a stressful situation. Being prepared, officials say, can save you precious time where seconds can mean life or death. Everyone thinks it's not going to happen to me. And if you talk to the people in Santa Rosa who lost an entire neighborhood, they'll say that. If you talk to the people who live in the town of Reading, they'll tell you they didn't think that was going to happen either. Now, I recently spoke with a family who was forced to evacuate from a wildfire. And while they did have a plan in place, they never went over it, and they were still caught off guard when they saw the flames. That's why officials say that it is so important, Sharin, to not only have a plan in place, but to also practice that plan. Yeah, you never think it can happen to you, so you can never be too prepared. Thanks for those reminders, Mark. Thanks.